So to begin your warm-up, dynamic functional warm-ups are great. This is an example of both a strength training exercise and a functional exercise, given I've got a weighted medicine ball. So I'm just going to step back in a rear lunge, safer for knees. And I started with strictly straight back. Now I'm adding the rotation. So just going over toward the side of the knee that raises. I'm just showing a different angle here so you can see, but I want you to watch the progression. I'm going straight back first. I'm going to increase the difficulty just slightly because I'm feeling stable. And if not, then this is enough for that day. But I'm adding a rotation. Notice that my head stays forward on these first few. Now if I'm ready to progress and I want to add the rotation, where your eyes go, the rest of your body wants to go. So that will be more of a challenge. So with this medicine ball chop right here, we're warming up just straight up and down the middle. Easy squats, just down and up, staying fairly deep. Now, from the side, it's still a good squat form. Knees over the toes, but no further forward. Nice and deep. Now we're going to go on an angle. So this is where we really start to get a little bit more functional, moving outside of forward and back or linear. So I'm going down and up toward an ankle, and then I need to do the opposite side. So from ankle to lift up and over a shoulder, make sure there is a little momentum that you're under control. We're going to focus here on core rotation. So take a dowel, or I've got a golf club right here, over a stability ball, and you could do this in a machine exercise if you were at a fitness center, but my hips stay stable, and I rotate from the torso with a very flat back, comfortably rotating my head and neck. So next, the flip side, supine, or lying face up. I'm rotating with a medicine ball on a stability ball, so a little tricky here. A lot of balance involved in this as well. Head and neck are off the ball, so you need to pay attention to that. I showed with my feet on the floor. Here I'm just demonstrating my feet are on that baseboard down at the floor and the corner where wall and floor meet at a 90 degree angle. So just another way to stabilize slightly more. Plank with rotation. So on all fours, top of a push-up is what it feels like. You're going to rotate and take the opposite knee underneath you and around. So this is great for golfers or anyone who does any rotational work, which is all of us. And for the bent over row, using a medicine ball demonstrated here, it's not a heavy exercise, but great for your postural muscles running up and down your spine should tip the head down so it stays in line with the spine. 